With so much investment now going into cybersecurity and antivirus software, we often forget that it's sometimes our own absent-minded behavior or indeed ignorance which is to blame for online security breaches. Well, that's what was on the agenda at this year's Internet Security Conference in Beijing. Our reporter Hu Ying has the story. Instead of discussing the latest technologies in international security, this year's conference focused more on what ordinary people can do to make cyberspace safer. I think it's a very good thing because human is the center of the digital life and that is as well a very important thing to generate security for different kind of infrastructures. The world has more than three billion internet users and nearly a quarter of those are in China. Growing industries like online mobile payments, sharing economy and artificial intelligence make China the leader in international technology. But this growth has also provided plenty of scope for illicit behavior. We used to think that loopholes were minor mistakes in software, but now people can hack through these loopholes and you can also defend yourself if you find them. So loopholes are very important strategic resources for a nation in the Internet age. In order to better protect the Chinese people's rights on the Internet, the country's cyber watchdog issued new regulations recently. We're going to monitor more information and evaluate more data to ensure the Internet is a safer place. We will also strictly attack illegal acts like online fraud, terrorist activity and false information on the Internet. However, apart from the lectures and speeches, there were some light-hearted attractions for the many visitors at the conference as well. I've been working in this industry for nine years. This year they're holding a lot of activities for people to participate in and learn. It's getting better year after year. Experts say our everyday lives are becoming more and more dependent on the Internet. And that can only be good news for cyber criminals. But they advise to stay vigilant and expect hidden threats and risks. And we can all do our bit to keep the Internet a safer place. Huying, CGTN, Beijing.